Hello everyone, Helen here with Helen Loves to Create and I'm bringing to you a thrifty haul. Um, so it's going to be some thrift stores and Dollar Tree items, um, mostly repurchases um, from Dollar Tree, um, but I'm super excited to show you what I picked up. I also found a little table outside of someone's home and um, they were throwing it out in um, bulk trash, I believe. And so I'm going to just show you uh, everything that I was able to find um, at these different thrift stores and antique store. So this is the small little table I picked up that was out on bulk trash um, I'm planning on using some contact paper that I have and covering this but it is a perfect little table and actually it fits perfectly right in underneath this one and then right against that one right there so it doesn't take up any extra space I found this table for $6.99 at Savers. And this is what it looks like open, which is 32 inches by 16 inches here. And they picked it up for $6.99. I wanted it for my sewing machine to be able to use it in my craft room and I can put it away whenever I'm done. So I went to the antique mall which I had never been to it um, and it was packed, so packed with beautiful antiques. Um, but I saw this trim and it's definitely vintage. Um, so pretty and so I picked it up one vendor was selling this by the yard so I picked up three yards for myself because I want to make some beautiful um, things with it so I think three yards is enough and then there was another vendor that was selling um, by the spool and this one says it has 150 yards. I'm not 100% sure if that is accurate, but this is also vintage lace. Um, yeah, vintage lace. And so I will be selling, um, definitely selling some of this during my sale. Um, I just thought it was so beautiful. Look at the details and all of this, guys. I am like blown away at the detail in all of these. So pretty. So, um, so yes, make sure you um, no put the notification bell so that you will be notified when I have the sale um, or when I announce it. So that way you'll be waiting for the sale. Um, this will be part, uh, one of the items in the sale. I had previously purchased this 12 inch and uh, by 30 centimeters um, Revere Wear, 1801 Revere Wear uh, stainless steel skillet. Um, and I paid $7 for it. I was super. Um, happy to purchase it at a thrift store but it didn't have a, the lid and I had been sharing the lid f with another one that I have for this one but today at Savers I was able to find a lid for it for $2.99 look a beautiful matching piece it matches perfectly with it um, oh, I'm so excited Guys, I'm so excited that um, I found the lid for it. Yay! Um, and I also picked this one up at Savers for $2.99. It's 
It says Google Fiber on there, but it has this band. So you just take this band off. And then it's got this little board here. But this is two different containers. And they both have these lids. And then inside of here, there is a little fork and butter knife. Um, so it's two containers and it is dishwasher safe um, it says it's wheat straw BPA free so I'm um, really excited about that so I guess if you wanted to like you can just have this lid on it, like that, but it doesn't really stay or anything like that. So see like this one, the lid does stay on it. So, but I really um, like the aesthetic of it, it's so pretty. This is for my lunches. I'm going to um, set myself some lunch aside too whenever I fix Sean's lunches. And, uh, yeah, like a little treat to me as well. These three came in this hanging package, Saver Style, for $3.99. And, of course, I wanted it for these two beauties. They are beautiful um, for salads. I didn't have a, a salad um, serving set and then this one came in there and I've already been pre-warned by a friend to be very careful with my beautiful fingers <laughs> um, this is a very dangerous but um, it does work and it's got three different levels so I'm actually kind of excited to use this one as well which I've already used this one that will you will see the picture of our salad here at the end <laughs> and at another thrift store I purchased this bag it says a lovely um, it just has like this faux cork um, style look which I absolutely love that um, it was only a dollar so I went ahead and went with it <laughs> And I thought these were so adorable that I picked them up. These are a dollar. These were a dollar fifty for the four set. And as you all know, um, my hubby and I eat a lot of boiled eggs, and so I just thought these were so adorable. So I had to pick them up. And I went ahead and picked up this little gravy bowl. Um, or. It has gravy pictures, what it's called. I'm not sure. It's only a dollar fifty, and um, I just really liked it. Um, most all of my dishes, all of our dishes, um, bowls, plates, salad plates, all of it is plain. So I um, wanted to make sure that what I got uh, was plain. So I was really happy with this one here. So, um, I think that I'll be using it for holidays or Thanksgiving or whenever I make gravy, which don't really make it too often, but I do know how, and, um, maybe this will be like a little encouragement to make a little sauce. Okay, and I picked up these from a little garage sale. These are little appliques for birds. Hay bugs, miniature flowers there. There's this gold filler paper, as you know, my favorite, one of my favorite colors. Um, I picked up this six by seven decorative edged tablet. It's Christmas style, double sided. Um, and I think it was like maybe a dollar or so. And then there was this Tim Holtz ideology. Um, journaling cover for a dollar so of course I picked that up because you know that's a 
super huge. Um, and then this one was like 25 cents, I think. Um, more geared to Valentine's Day. So. Yep. So I'm in the process of repairing um, these uh, some boots from my hubbies. Hopefully this will work. And I always hit up the clearance aisle to see what they have. And I thought these straws were so pretty. And even these diamonds on here are really cute and have little glue dots, which I don't have to use them together for anything. Um, I can do whatever I want. So these, I'm probably going to keep them, the straws, to use them for when I have guests over and, you know, um, little disposable cups and stuff like that. In some of my excursions, I guess I hit up Hobby Lobby, and I think that's the only two things I picked up from there. I really loved these stickers, or 74 cents, originally $3, and I thought they were really cute. I actually want to put them on a little recipe tin thing I have, and then these, oh my gosh, um, they are the bee, the bees and the flowers, and it's super cute. So, and these are also 74 cents, originally $3. So, I was really happy to pick these two up. So, from Dollar Tree, I pick up um, this cleaning vinegar. I use it in our laundry, and it helps get a lot of different soils out. Um, so, it works really well. Of course, I use it for cleaning and put it into uh, cleaning bottles with essential oils as well. And so, um, it comes in handy. For a dollar twenty-five, you get sixty-four full ounces. So that's actually a really good price. And then um, I picked this up. This is fairly new. It's by Maids Smart Six Grippies. There is a total of six in here um, to put them on the bottom of your tub. So, um, I was kind of surprised to find them. Um, and so, yeah, you just put them on the bottom of your tub and it helps keep you. I don't like the mats, um, so I think this would be a good alternative. Um, it's got little miniature suction cups, so we shall see. Hopefully it works. If you're not too picky with your toothbrushes, it's a really good place to pick up toothbrushes, two packs, um, sometimes even four packs, depending. They do get a little bit more thinner in the plastic, um, more, you know, not a great plastic. But this one is soft, it's really good um, toothbrushes. We buy them from Dollar Tree, and it gets our teeth clean, so I guess it works for us. And then, um, hubby needed some, um, shower gel, and so he picked this one up. It's got, uh, different vitamins, paraben-free and silicone-free, and it smells pretty good. This Ocean Surge smell from VO5. It says it has three-in-one, but he usually mainly uses it as a body wash. And he did pick up the Power Stick Extreme Cool Blast, which smells really great. And then this one... As well, it's an Ultra Max Fresh Smell. So, um, these are great prices for Dollar Tree. So, this is something new I hadn't seen at Dollar Tree. It says it's a Glass Plus Cleaning um, Wipes. So, I'm going to try them out. See, it says it's streaks free. Um, but, I'm probably going to use it for more than just... Um, windows honestly or glass because um, it's for cleaning it's 160 wipes for a dollar 25 so that's really good here's just a basics uh, dollar uh, 25 for 150 napkins and then I've never used this one so I went ahead and picked this one up it says love my carpet it is a foaming carpet cleaning spray and vacuum self cleaning formula if you've used it please leave me a comment down below let me know um is it good 
I'm going to use it um, soon. So we shall see. Um, looks like I have quite a few things. I will be seeing how well they work. Um, hopefully I don't uh, have any mishaps. <laughs> um, I also picked up this one here. It is uh, Sure Fresh. It is two pack. Um, they did have a three pack in uh, ombre color, so this was like two light colors. They had another one where it was three, but they don't have them anymore, um, which is kind of a bummer because um, I think I got them for like a dollar, not a dollar twenty five, and I got three. So, anyways, but um, these are still good buy. Um, at two of them for a dollar twenty five, and then. I always pick up our sandwich bags there as well. There's 40 um, resealable, um, you know, just a, whatever that's called, a little zipper on there. And then as far as um, Reynolds wrap, I think that this is a really good way to have it already pre-cut. Um, and usually the 14 by 10 inch um, size is really really good so um I, i'm not sure well i don't think each one is 14 this is how much it is total in here but each pre-cut sheet i wish it did tell you that hold on um actually works really really well so i like that i like using it like this um because it's pre-cut and usually it works for whatever i need it to be so or not i use two of them I picked these up for Outgoing Mail, which is the purple, white, and pink shred. I don't know what I'm going to be using these for yet, but I also picked up these um, eight-piece um, wooden acorns and eight-piece um, So I don't know what I'm going to be using these for yet, but I picked up the eight piece set of wooden acorns and mushrooms. They were so adorable. I probably already have these two sets in my stash, but I every time I see them I think they're so beautiful. So I went ahead and picked this one up again. I'm not 100% sure if I have this one in my stash or not, um, with the beautiful flowers uh beautiful flower butterflies oh, that just seems like it's a lot of detail for it to try and focus um so beautiful these butterflies here okay. and then i don't know if i've shown you this before i haven't yet used it so um i did pick this up to have cutting dies at dollar tree so i picked these up they also have the hearts like hearts within each other but I didn't pick them up because I already have heart dies so I wasn't gonna pick up something I already had and I don't have anything like this one right here in the middle so that's why I did pick it up and then um, I thought this was interesting and this is like um velvet push pins they look like they're for upholstery and they also have dark blue um, ones as well and they also have pearl circle pearl ones uh with a little push pin so this is twin count this is the corner office by jot so i'm kind of interested in seeing what other um things this particular label is going to bring out because that's pretty cool and then the last of this haul which was super long thank you um was this journaling pen magna tank a uh, smooth gel comfort grip and it's a blank ink it is 0.7 and i think i need to try it out so just bear with me so i love the black and gold um and I love the chunkiness in it. It's super thick. And it does have the lid. It comes off. I know a lot of people don't like that. But I don't mind it because I always just 
insert my lids on my pins and use them. So. Yeah. It's hard to keep the <laughs> I'm trying my best to hold this camera so that you can see me writing with it um, but it's so hard to do both and then <laughs> and then write so yes please like comment and subscribe and thank you all for watching alright guys you have a blessed one Bye.